There is so much good high school basketball being played right now. It's a great chance to see future stars become before they become household names in college and the pros, Marshall. Yeah, Erica and Jim, the Rolling Meadows boys basketball team is having another very good season, and it's another Christie helping to lead the Mustangs charge. Matt Zahn caught up with Cameron Christie, who's following in his older brother's footsteps while making his own mark along the way. Cameron Christie is enjoying the ride in his senior season at Rolling Meadows High School. Yes, it's been a ton of fun, you know, halfway through it. I've really enjoyed every single moment of it. I'm looking forward to having the second half as well. That will likely include many more highlight-making plays from the Minnesota commit, who's one of the top players in the state. He's just really good. He, he can score at three levels. He can shoot from outside. He's got a mid-range game. He can go to the basket. He makes the right play. You know, he makes tough shots. It's a, it's a real privilege to have someone that good on our team. While Cameron is the clear star of the team, he certainly doesn't act like it. That was especially true during the recruiting process that he went through without much fanfare. Our whole family has always taught us to be humble and stuff like that. You know, there's no need to, to post every single offer and stuff like that. There's just no need to do that. You know, um, just keep it to yourself. Humility isn't the only thing Cameron got from his family. The basketball genes are pretty good as well. His brother Max was a star at Rolling Meadows before going to Michigan State and then getting drafted by the Lakers this year. And both his parents played college basketball, his dad at UW-Superior, and his mom at Northwestern. It was very helpful to have people that have gone through the whole process before. You know, they were, they were to teach us a lot of things, especially my dad. You know, he was the one that always taught us how to shoe, always did all those workouts with us when we were younger. Nice to have those jeans too, right? Yes, yes. It's been very helpful to have um, tall, tall mom. Cameron says he's learned a lot from his older brother, Max, as well. Always have confidence in yourself. You know, he went through that little, that little wall at Michigan State and stuff like that. But, um, you know, he learned from that. You know, he learned how to, how to battle the adversity. So I've been trying to implement that myself. You know, always stay confident no matter what's going on. Max has even gotten a couple of starts with the Lakers as a rookie second-round draft pick. It's a lot of fun, you know, to be able to turn on, turn on national TV and see him out there with, um, with the Lakers, playing with LeBron and AD and Russ and all those, all those you know, superstars. But with a few injuries, you know, he was able to, to take the opportunities, made the most of it. Christie got the start tonight. Having both of the Christie brothers do a lot of good stuff at Rolling Meadows has made this a pretty fun stretch of coaching for Kevin Kadovich. It's been something that, unless you're going through it, you don't appreciate how special it is to have two generational players, and they got to play together for two years as well. Max is in the NBA. I think Cameron's headed to the NBA, too. They've done more for our school than we've done for them. And you said there no more Christie's coming through? Unfortunately not. I've, I've talked to Max and Katrina to see if there's someone they're surprising me with later, but no, that this is the last. So as Cam said, all that's left is to enjoy the rest of this ride. In Rolling Meadows, Matt Zahn, CBS2 News.